Mission log number 567. So I just survived Io, and now I'm about to head to Ganymede. Hello, Ganymede. Oh, it's you. I've heard about you. Anyways, what are you up to? Oh, I'm here to, um, land on your surface. What? So we will see if you're the best for life. Oh, okay. You're one of the first ones to land on me to find life. Well, that's cool. Anyways, I'll see you later, guy, mate. Let's see if you have life. All right. <sighs> okay. Computer, we have landed on the surface of Ganymede. So, our plan, our mission, is to find water or life. Well, we should go to the underwater ocean of Ganymede. Yeah, that's a good idea, computer. There should be something to go down. You know what? Let's just go. Hey, you're Ganymede, right? Uh, yeah. You know... This isn't his first time visiting a moon. Also, you are very lucky that you have an underwater ocean, huh? Uh, I guess. Titan, do you want to know more about Earth Goes to the Sun? Yeah, then use Patreon. By supporting our Patreon, you'll help us to make three long videos every month, plus all the amazing rewards we have for you. How about early content? This video has been on Patreon for some time now. Behind the scenes, deleted scenes, your name in the credits, tutorials by the creators on how to make an animated show, and an exclusive look at the development of the Astro Dude movie. Wow, this is amazing. Can you tell me the tears? Of course! Comet, Moon, Planet, and Star. Each with their own unique rewards so everyone can join our mission. Any support is always welcome. However, keep in mind that the higher tiers have a limited number of people that can join. So if you're interested, you better be quick. Thanks to all the Patreons that already support us. And to the new ones, welcome to the team. All right, back to the video! Okay, computer. Where's the underground or underwater ocean? It's right over there. Over there. Really? Okay. Oh, wow, computer, look. I can see Jupiter, and I can see Io and Europa. It looks beautiful, Astro, dude. We've been going for a long time now, and I still can't find the underwater ocean. I guess I'm going to need some help. Oh, hey, how's the entry to the space like? It's, uh, pretty, pretty cool. Okay, well, what are you doing right now? I'm currently on Ganymede. Gotcha. Okay, if you're busy, I'll call you later, okay? No, 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 I actually need help here on Ganymede. My help? Okay, so Ganymede has a magnetic field and is the only moon to ever have a magnetic field. It is also the biggest moon in our solar system. Also, rumors say that Europa has twice as much water as on Earth. But as for Ganymede, it's possible that there could be less water than probably all of, all of them. Hey, Astro dude, down there! Don't listen to her! Io is the, has the least amount of water compared to any object in the solar system. Oh, computer, you're wrong. I'm sorry, Astro dude. And why does it feel like there's air? That's because Ganymede could possibly have an a atmosphere, a very thin atmosphere of oxygen. Okay, uh, honey? Oh, come on, why am I losing my signal again? That's because Ganymede is very cold. Well, I don't want to freeze too. I'll get you a new suit, okay? Oh, that's much better. Okay, since we got a new suit, now let's go. Oh, wow, I think we found our target. There is a big hole there that leads to the underwater ocean of Ganymede. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna jump in it. Wait, don't do it. <gasps> hey, uh, Ganymede? What is it, Ayo? Do you think that you're the best for life? I mean, maybe. Considering that Astro Dude did say that he's going to each of us and to see if which one is the best for life. Uh, I think Europa could be one. But what about me and Callisto? And you are the only one that is the different from all of us. So you won't have any life anytime sooner. Ha ha! 
Oh, come on, Ganymede. Wow. Oh, we must be here. Yes, Astro Dude. This is the underwater ocean of Ganymede. Okay, so what's the plan now? Well, as always, we have to see if we can find any life. And if there isn't, then Ganymede won't be the best for life. But Ganymede has an underwater ocean, so they should have life soon. Well, how about we have to go deep in order to find life? Well, about 60 miles of ocean under Ganymede's main surface. 60 miles? Can I really survive that? Well, yes, wait for a new suit. Ugh, okay, time to start looking. Okay, after this, I should be done with my mission. Alright, without further ado, let's go. Ganymede! Ugh, what is it this time, Io? Where is Astro, dude? He's in my surface. Wait, what? Impossible! Your surface temperature is about like negative 300 degrees in Fahrenheit. Whoa! I'm surprised you know that. I pay attention to Mr. Jupiter. Yeah, we know, Io. We know. Now, if you excuse me, I got more important matters to attempt to get out of here. Ugh, fine. Oh my god, oh my ears are ringing. That's because of the pressure. Yes, I know. Well, we've been going for like, I don't know, five minutes and we still can't find another life. Even if we go deeper, we'll be crushed by the pressure. So, I guess we are alone here in Ganymede. Yes, I was right, Astro Dude. Yeah, you're right. Anyways, it's time to go back to lab before I get crushed by the pressure. Ah, <sighs> I'm back. Okay, now let's go. <sighs> hey, Ganymede. So, what did you find? Well, I found nothing except for an underwater ocean. Now, if you excuse me, I gotta go back to Callisto on my base and pack up everything since I'm leaving. What do you mean? Ganymede, I'm leaving the Juvian system. Why? What? Why? Because I need to continue my mission. Oh, well, go do that. Thanks, Ganymede. <sighs> hey, Europa. What, Ganymede? Astro Dude is done visiting us with his mission. Wait, Astro Dude is done with his mission of visiting us? Well, yes. Hmm. I have an idea. Okay. I've packed up, now it's time to leave, and this base will sit here for a little while. Goodbye base, and goodbye Callisto, and goodbye the Juvine system. So, you visited all of the four main moons of Jupiter? Yep, wasn't easy to give you that, but I did the mission. Oh, that's glad to hear, Astro Dude. I'm happy for you. Anyways, you are now free to go and do whatever you want. Thanks. Wait, Astro Dude, which is the best one for life? I'd say Europa, Callisto, and Ganymede could be the best for life. But I'm assuming that Ganymede could be the best for life. Okay, now you're free to do whatever you want. Thanks. Goodbye. Alright, I guess I'll just continue my mission. I guess. Wait, Astro Dude, look behind you. What? Uh, what the? Thanks for visiting us, Astro Dude. Whoa, uh, what's all this? This is a goodbye party since we heard that you're leaving. Oh, thank you guys. I'll see you again soon. Goodbye. 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 Ah, what an adventure. the series and thanks to Lucas the planet for doing the voice for your upper anyways bye